This is Jesus Manuel Menegarza. I hope you're doing fantastic wherever you're at. I'm going to try to keep this uh, short and to the point. I'm checking out the Ember Recreational Vehicles website. I had the opportunity to see some of the products uh, close up at the uh, at the AT&T Stadium where the Dallas Cowboys football team play. Uh, an event sponsored by the folks at Funtown RV here in uh, Claiborne, uh, Texas, near Fort Worth, Texas, where I live. And I saw their Ember products and I was really impressed especially by the suspension and the exterior construction i thought was impressive and uh, they do have an impressive price point uh, compared to most uh, you know travel trailers they offer a premium product and they're offering premium pricing or as their ceo says a value product because they have a lot of value okay so i have quite a few products here i'm, I'm not going to go over all of them they have the overland micro series that's a small uh, travel trailer. Let me just show you down here. It's a very small uh, travel trailer. Two wheels and they have a little futon and, uh, and some examples like the roll. They have all the empty space back here but in the rock they have an outside kitchen and uh, a cooler, a refrigerator. Pretty simple. They're you know about 2,000, 200, 2,000 pounds in that range. And very nice. And of course if you add extras uh, it adds to the weight. And their exterior length is only 12 feet 10 inches under 13 feet very nice easily towable by a lot of small uh, suvs etc etc your basic jeep can tow this rather readily again, again uh, your basic jeep uh, with the standard little v6 can tow this rather readily so they have other products also they have the overland series uh, these and they, i really like by the way i just want to emphasize here i really like the marketing department's work at the ember recreational vehicles they have some great photographs and they also show quite a bit of diversity which i appreciate also so let me scroll down here uh, these models the first models this year like the 170 mrb and the 170 mbh are two-wheeled models but when you get to the bottom, they have a couple new models, which are really impressive. Uh, the 201 FBQ, I like that one. I really do. If you have some kids, of course, you're going to want the bunk bed model, uh, the 221 MDB. So these have a dry weight. Uh, right here, let me click on this. Uh, very nice photograph. This one has a very nice layout. And it has a dry weight of uh, 5,255 pounds, gross vehicle weight rating of 6,575 pounds, fresh water capacity 55 gallons, uh, gray water capacity 35, and black 35, and propane 40. 24 feet, 1 inch. So it has a 60 by 80 queen bed up front, a jackknife sofa, my uh, Rockwood has two recliners. Very nice, I really appreciate it. This is exactly the same layout pretty much 95 percent as my rockwood mini light 2205s you got the shower in the corner and the sink is even in the same place the toilet's in the same place the refrigerator's in the same place it's all the stuff's in the same place and of course the uh, kitchen's in the same place the bed's in the same place la 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 it has a slide a more modest slide than the rockwood so the big selling point of this unit is uh, right here. It's right, it says right here, right here. <laughs> it says Kurt Independent Suspension, heavy doodly, do, uh, doodly. Hmm. Kurt Independent Suspension, heavy duty, that's better. Coil springs with dual shock absorbers on each wheel. So you have four of those. Very nice. And of course, it's uh, absolutely well built. It has a, you know, metal superstructure on the outside but keeps everything in place not just uh, some plastic trim okay i do like the uh, acrylic windows i do not i would not order with the stargazer window i'm not a big fan of the stargazer just uh, another area where it might get some water intrusion but a lot of people like those options and of course the salesman or saleswoman is going to say you must get this and of course they do offer a solar package various solar packages and every year as we uh, go through the 20s 22 23 24 25 there's going to be more solar sold by a lot of rv companies so let's go back to the stories this is some of the stories you can go to their website and download their ebook and uh, check out their little stories 
And here's some information about the company. Very nice company. Again, beautiful photographs. As a photographer and as a person who worked in marketing for a utility for many years, and a person who created the first website for that utility, Pedernales Electric Cooperative uh, from the Austin, San Antonio area. Uh, I, you know, I really appreciate the high quality of their marketing vision. Of course, after you find out what the uh, founder, president, CEO, her background is, you understand why. Ashley Bontrager Lehman. Uh, she has a degree in public relations and advertising. Amazing. No wonder their website is so fantastic. And they have a bunch of staff here, Chris Barth, etc. And you can go check out all the different members of the uh, Ember Recreational Vehicles team. So if you want to check out one of these units, I know in Fort Worth uh, nearby in Claiborne they have them. Uh, they, they have them actually in stock uh, in July of 22. These units are being sold very, very fast. And again, they are a premium product. My Rockwood, if you looked at the MRSRP and then you com and you compared the same, essentially the same unit to a uh, Ember vehicle, uh, tra you know, tra travel trailer, it's going to cost you $15,000 more. So you get a lot more value as a CEO would say, value in an Ember product. So check out your local dealership. Uh, again, here in Fort Worth, Texas, over there in Claiborne, we have a Funtown RV. Very nice folks down there. Uh, they have an extensive inventory of a lot of stuff. Uh, even in July, they have a lot of stuff. I don't know if they have any embers. I, I went down to a location I couldn't find one. I wanted to take some big trees. Of course, you can uh, find out their dealerships in your local area. And of course, you can always go uh, to the Ember Recreational Vehicles website and they'll give you some information and assist you. Or you can just call them. I'm pretty sure their phone number, just call them and say, hey, where's my, where's a dealership near here in Duluth, Minnesota where I can buy one? Because I want to buy one, maybe even buy two. Why not? So again, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. I would greatly appreciate it. And if you have the time, and only if you have the time, please leave your kind and super friendly comments and suggestions below. I would greatly appreciate it. And of course, uh, check out my Patreon page, patreon.com slash Garza. Muchos, muchos gracias. Again, if you have any questions about this unit, I would contact the folks at Ember or your local Ember dealership. I'm just checking out their website and saying, man, this is a very nice website. They have some very nice products and I really like their new four wheel, uh, you know, uh, travel trailers. I, I would love to have one if I had an extra 15,000 bucks, but at this time I don't. Hope you're doing fantastic. From Fort Worth, Texas, this has been Asus Manuel Menegarza for RV and Travel Adventures. Hope you're doing super, super fantastic. Gracias. Adios. Bye-bye.